वेलकम टू एन यूनिवर्स डबल टू टूडे वी विल डिस्कस डाउन फ्लो सर्फेस कंडेंसर इन डाउन फ्लो सर्फेस कंडेंसर द एग्जोस्ट स्ट्रीम एंटर सेट द टॉप एंड फ्लो डाउनवर्ड्स सो दिस इज द आउटर बॉडी ऑफ द डाउन फ्लो सर्फेस कंडेंसर एंड एग्जोस्ट स्ट्रीम दिस इज द एग्जोस्ट स्ट्रीम इलेट दैट एंटर सेट द टॉप एंड दीज आर द वाटर ट्यूब्स इन द मिडल ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर कंडेंसर and exhaust steam that is moving from top to bottom so these are the buffers are provided at the near the bottom basically the main use of the buffer to prevent the entry of the condensed stream into it and as steam flows perpendicular to the direction of the flow of the cooling water as the cooling water that is flowing through the water tubes so here the stream that is flowing downward over the tubes due to the force of the gravity as well as the suction of the extraction air pump fitted at the bottom and the condensate that is collected at the bottom and then pumped by the extraction pump the dry air pump suction pipe which is provided near the bottom so this is the working of the down flow surface condenser as steam flows perpendicular to the direction of flow of the cooling water inside the tubes this is also called a cross surface condenser so today we have learnt about down flow surface condenser how it works and the main parts of the down flow surface condenser in our next video we will discuss about central flow surface condenser and this is the longitudinal section of the boiler how the water is flowing through the tubes the cooling water flows in one direction through the lower half of the tubes and returns in the opposite direction through the upper half so this is the way how water is flowing throughout the cycle if you like this video share among your friends and students subscribe for getting more videos on mechanical engineering topics any universe double two on youtube and you may like its facebook page also you can ask your queries by commenting give your suggestions if required thank you have a nice day